What's good, YouTube? Vikasa Kavi here. So, Upchurch has remixed the push ups Drake instrumental that was like a diss to 20 different fucking people from Drake. <laughs> we didn't cover that on here, but I definitely listened to it, and that was some flame right there. I can't even lie about that. That was some serious shit that he was talking in that one. Very much so. An awesome beat. So I wonder what kind of flow up Church is going to give us. I'm not surprised that he jumps on a remix like this for a, a diss track. Spe like a specified beat for a diss track that Drake used. I'm not surprised that Church would do this after certain things that have happened, right? We had God Mode got put out. And then we ha also just have a lot of talk that goes on online all the time people talking shit on church and stuff like that i mean people are talking shit on everybody let's be real right <laughs> people are talking shit on everybody at this point it's just the fucking run of the mill how it goes nowadays that's where we're at with it right so church has put out a diss track against i don't know who it doesn't say but it's on Captain Kurt React's channel, so it's cool that Church allowed Captain Kurt to upload this specifically to his channel. That's really fucking awesome of Church to do stuff like that. It's not the first time I've seen him do this and let somebody else upload something that he was putting out. I love when he does that. It's super cool of him that he allows people to do that from time to time. I'm excited to see what up Church gives us. If it's a diss track, it's just going to be fucking wild and that's all there is to it church never fails when it comes to a diss track he's on tour right now and playing a bunch of shows and traveling and he managed to uh grab a hold of this right after it came out and then fucking do something with it while on tour that's wild church is a workhorse man he really works his ass off doesn't he somehow I mean, it's one day ago. Yeah, it just became one day ago. Someone already put the lyric sheet up. There's already a lyric sheet up, too. So we have that as well. If you guys are new here, hit that subscribe for me. We're here for the bars in this one. I like breaking everything down and going the whole nine yards on that with analyzing the bars and shit. I like to go into an extensive breakdown when it comes to bars, especially in a diss track, because there's a lot of witty stuff and doubles and stuff like that that's usually going on in them. So we will see what kind of bars we get from church. I'm excited for this one. Shout out church. Shout out Captain Kurt for uploading this for everybody. Fucking dope that they worked together on that. Let's get into it. I'm Vikasa Kavi. A reaction video a day keeps the doctor away. Fuck those apples. This is Push Ups Drake Instrumental Remix by Church. Diss track season. Church, motherfucker. Yeah. I like oh, yeah. beat. Ain't nobody dissing me unless my whole name in it But that shit don't ever happen cause I'm dangerous competition yeah. Manny Pacquiao, all my shots got repetition And my reputation flawless even with the abolition I Oh no Oh no <laughs> Church wants someone to diss him <laughs> I think that's what this might be This might be directed in the area of Tom Right? It might be aimed towards Tom could even be shots at ACOW. It's hard to tell. We'll find out as we get further into it. But I think this is more so. I think Church just might want somebody to try to diss him because he feels like competing right now. I think that that's just the mode that he's in right now. And he's trying to get somebody to actually try to come at him by showing off his wordplay in a very aggressive manner like this. I like it. I like it so far. Great rhyme scheme. We'll get into that. Shit don't ever happen cause I'm dangerous competition Manny Pacquiao, all my shots got repetition And my reputation flawless even with the abolition yeah. I stay optimistic, can't help but start to giggling They optic locked in on my business, still missing Cause they forgot to wipe the lenses Couldn't yeah. see his own agenda Ain't no rapper fucking with me, I'm the gang's referendum right, And they fed up, I'm like the feds when I document them Too soft, you not the shit, that's a small percenter Have a wow. baby by me, baby, I don't do apprenticeship And I be on the wave, got them drowning while they skinny dipping 
His fucking syllable placement is different. I say that all the time about Church. He's very unorthodox, and I like that about his flow style. He puts little pauses and draws in weird places to fit certain things in the way he wants them to and that sort of thing. He'll, he's not afraid to have an uneven syllable placement as well inside of the pockets that he gets into, especially in diss tracks. He's got this kind of flow that I don't hear anybody else ever do when it comes to diss tracks. Specifically in the diss tracks, he really goes off on these tangents that are very strange sometimes, where like a bar up here will be here, and then two bars will happen, and then the rhyme will happen here. The fourth bar down, right? Church does shit like that a lot in his diss tracks. I like that about it. But let's cover these first few lyrics here. Ain't nobody dissing me unless my whole name in it, but that shit don't ever happen because I'm dangerous competition. Nice start out. That's a solid opening bar. Manny Pacquiao, all my shots got repetition. My reputation flawless even with the abolition. Pfft. My reputation flawless even with the abolition. Damn. I stay optimistic. Can't help to stop the giggling. They optic locking on my business. Wow. They optic locking on my business. <laughs> <laughs> I stay optimistic though. <laughs> Can't help to stop the giggling. <laughs> they optic lock it on my business. That's a hell of a scheme. Still missing. Cause they forgot to wipe their lens. <laughs> Saying y'all bitches are over here crying crocodile tears and you fogged up your lenses. That's what he's saying. They're fogged up because you're crying too much. <laughs> couldn't see his own agenda. Saying, oh my god, bro. Saying you couldn't, he's saying, whoever he's talking to in this right now, whichever one of you he's talking to, he's saying you couldn't even see the own plan that you were trying to make. Ain't no rapper fucking with me, I'm the game's referendum. And they fed up them like the feds when I document them. Nice scheme, bro. His syllable placement is incredible, like I said. Too soft, you not the shit, that's a small percenter. Have a baby, buy me baby, I don't do apprenticeship. And I'll be on the wave, got them drowning while they skinny dip in. <laughs> so... They're crying and they fogged up their glasses and then they got thrown into the water naked and now church is the wave that's coming to sweep them away. <sighs> and they can't, he's saying you can't even see your own plan. He's basically, well, whoever he's talking to is saying that they can't see their head from their ass is exactly what he's saying in this. <laughs> I'm all here for it. <laughs> Tallest in the room, even if I'm Jimmy Dickens. Six oh. strings, seven bitches, eight my oppositions. If a diss coming, then you undercover with it, cause you duck in church, put the devil lotty in the kitchen. Can't kill. <laughs> I don't know what to expect with church ever, man. I love stuff like this whenever he gets into this bag. His schemes, like I said, you never know which pocket he's gonna dive into it's so unbalanced with a diss track he's the tallest in the room even if i'm jimmy dickens <laughs> six string seven bitches ate my oppositions but eight as in like actually ate them right devoured them if a diss coming and you undercover with it because you duck in church but the devil already in the kitchen Mm, he said the devil's already cooking, man. Damn. <laughs> Tallest in the room, even if I'm Jimmy Dickens. Six strings, seven bitches, eight my oppositions. If a diss coming, then you undercover with it, cause you duck in church, put the devil out in the kitchen. Can't kill out of hidden propane switches. Hey. Got the gas, don't make me blow up more in my position. Quit playing this through paying for Ukrainians to listen. Now they in their feelings, cause I don't never sit to listen in. Stop attending wow. you motherfuckers. A life living, you light them and you're spending your night minutes destroying your sight vision. Get a night light for your lame gimmick wow. lines. Brain mimicking the same rhythm every single time. Al Gore of algorithm saying some doing different. Don't know where to fit in. Tried every outfit and fitted. This not a level of realm and for you. It's restricted because you are chasing them dollars like a rural town stripper. Uh -huh. My goodness. 
Church is fucking wild, bro. Church is and I, we're getting our answer here because the next bar says Goldilocks from Canada. He's talking to Tom. <laughs> I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it, man. <laughs> Church ain't gonna leave it alone, man. <laughs> He's not one to leave it alone. <laughs> My word. I like the scheme that he's on here. Hank Hill out here hitting propane switches. <sighs> that show's fucking awesome. King of the Hill is one of my favorite shows ever. That shit's fucking hilarious, dude. I like the episode where Hank accidentally gets high. Where... <laughs> <laughs> he accidentally smokes. <laughs> He's freaking the fuck out. <laughs> that that one's one of my fucking favorite ones. <sighs> fucking funny show right there. He said, Got the gas, don't make me blow up more in my position. Quit playing, it's too paying for Ukrainians to listen. <sighs> it's too pay, too pay. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Church. The doubles. I love doubles, man. Now they in their feelings because I don't never sit to listen in. Stop pretending you motherfuckers are life living your light dimming. You spending your night minutes destroying your sight vision. Get a night light for your lame gimmick. That's a beautiful scheme right there. That's a very nice structure right there. The way that that flows even when you just read it out like that. That is fucking crazy. He said, stop pretending you motherfuckers are life living. You're light dim and dim and, and see, see how he, his scheme is so crazy. He said, dim and, and, and was the rhyme for living, right? Wow. Life living, you're light dimming. Oh my God. Light dim in though. You're dim ing. God damn, there's another double. You're spending your night minutes destroying your sight vision. Sight vision could also refer to the website destroying the vision of your movement. Get a night light for your lame gimmick. Yeah, that's definitely aimed at Tom. Lines lame mimicking the same rhythm every single time. Al Gore of algorithm Al Gore of algorithms. <laughs> I like that one. I like that one. That was fun. Saying something, doing different. Oh, yeah, saying something, doing different. It's, yeah, I did critique that whenever we covered Tom's track, how he talks about designer and stuff, but then says that I like songs like Burning Burning My Designer is a song that's on an album, and it's about burning your designer. And he said, fuck all that. You don't need all that in some instances, but then he flexed it in God mode specifically. He flexed it a couple times. And I actually commented on that when I reacted to that. I called that out. Saying something, doing different. Don't know where to fit and tried every outfit and fitted. Yeah. Yeah. He has he has had every fucking style and from one end of the spectrum to the other. I mean I guess Tom's just an eccentric and eclectic person, but who knows, man? Who fucking knows at the end of the day? I imagine Church probably knows more things than we do, like a lot of things that we don't know. So, when he talks his shit, I imagine he has a decent reason for it amongst his own thoughts, right? <laughs> It's not a level of Roman for you. It's restricted Roman. Oh, he said realm, Roman. Oh my God. Like it being in the realm, right? But realm, like as in roaming as well. That's not a level of Roman for you. It's restricted because you out chasing them dollars like you a rural town stripper. Oh boy. A rural town stripper, that is desperation like a motherfucker right there. Any tourist that comes through is getting it easy. That's what he's saying. Wow. <laughs> he said it's easy to make you do something for money. That's what Church just said with that. Wow. That's disrespectful, Church. Jesus.
Mind mimicking the same rhythm every single time I'll go of algorithm saying something doing different Don't know where to fit in, tried every outfit and fitted This not a level of realm and for you it's restricted Cause you out chasing them dollars like a rural town stripper Cody uh, locks from Canada but this that down south shit yeah. Use the propaganda that you throwing as a niche I'ma yeah. feed it back to you one hand and a big I'm so fire flame every disremembered like it's Auschwitz Have a shootout with two language scripts I'm a bicentennial baby pick you off from a picket Hold no wait <laughs> We're not gonna bypass that, church. What the fuck, homie? <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, my God. He said, Goldilocks from Canada, but this, that, down south shit. Use the propaganda that you throw in as a niche. I'm gonna feed it back to you one hand and a bick. I'm so fire flame every disremembered like it's Auschwitz. Ouch, wits, right? Ouch to he's putting Tom at his wits. Oh my god. He's like my disses will put a person at their wits end. My word boy. Ouch wits like ouch wits. Jesus Christ. Church is ridiculous. Like you have to really think about it to catch his bars, and that is so morbid, but very well done. <laughs> Leave it to church, man. Leave it to church, for real. Whew. It tried every outfit and fitted. This not a level of realm and for you it's restricted because you are chasing them dollars like a rural building. town stripper. Uh -huh. Cody locks from Canada, but this that down south shit. Use the propaganda that you throw in as a niche. I'ma feed it back to your one hand and a pick. I'm so fire flame every disremembered like it's Auschwitz. Have a shootout with two language scripts. I'm a bicentennial baby, pick you off from a picket fence Blood sink, that's me, I just need a quick rinse Hit the 808, I'm tapping in, past the six cents Nobody Damn. at it function in this dimension I'm living in, it's like I'm standing in the lens And really get to watch the shit Got my remote, change the channel when I want to And the one I'm on, I don't even know you Matter of fact, Man. fuck the TV game, ain't even got new So many ghost writers room, vibe like cement tombs These people dusty, so I hit them with a thick broom Whoa, hold on, hold on Hold on. Wait. Wait, church. Wait. <laughs> Did you just say Tom got a room full of ghostwriters? How do you know that? How do you know? Tell us. You gotta tell us, church. Right? <laughs> you gotta tell us. <laughs> oh my goodness, bro. He said, have a shootout with two language scripts. Oh my goodness. I'm a bicentennial baby. Pick you off from a picket fence. Language scripts, picket fence. Jesus. Blood sink, that's me. I just need a quick rinse. Hit the 808. I'm tapping in past the sixth sense. Nobody, add, nobody added function in this dimension that I'm living in. It's like I'm standing in the lens and really get to watch the shit. That's a bar right there. Wow. Standing in the lens. Oh, oh my goodness. He's still on the lens scheme, but he's like, I'm like in your lens. Like, I can Wow. 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 He lives in their mind's eye. That's what he's saying. I think that's what he's saying with that. That's how I take that. It's like he's in their mind's eye. Wow. Got my remote, changed the channel when I want to, and the one I'm on, I don't even know you. Damn, bro. Matter of fact, fuck a TV, game ain't even got new. Game ain't even got new, he said. It's same old shit, different day, he said. Matter of fact, fuck a TV, game ain't even got new. So many ghost writers room vibe like cement tombs. These people dusty, so I hit them with a thick broom, he says. Good lord. Church, you gotta, you gotta enlighten us on that, man. I don't know if he's talking about Tom's ghostwriters, or is he talking about Drake ghostwriters as well? Because we all know everybody be joking about Drake's ghostwriters every fucking day. If you go into the comment section, that's all you see, so like... <laughs> 
I don't know. I think that's a shot at Tom still. I think he's still going in on Tom. I don't think he's going to take a shot at Drake necessarily. I don't think so, at least. So I think that's aimed at Tom, which, if it is, who? And where's the proof? We need the proof. We need the receipts on that one because that one would change a lot of things, right? And it's like I'm standing in the lens and really get to watch the shit Got my remote, change the channel when I want to And the one I'm on, I don't even know you Matter of fact, fuck a TV game, ain't even got new So many ghost writers room, vibe like cement tombs These people dusty, so I hit them with a thick broom I'm fly like my spelling, need a cauldron and a big spoon Call it witchcraft when I pick which switch I flick Activated divine hick, universal line This is my sign, it's a sidekick Don't give a damn who you side with Barging in the room, the levy broke my flow level at high risk and I'ma flood a motherfucker Yeah And I'ma disappear for nothing Yeah And I'ma go and grab the ghillie Sneak around every enemy to envy the fact that I don't never sleep And I'm Good God The flow that he's in right now is so unorthodox with the syllable placement It's very amazing And what he said here is incredible This is a beautiful scheme that he just went on these people dusty, so I hit them with a thick broom. I'm flyer like my spell and need a cauldron and a big spoon. Call it witchcraft when I pick which switch I flick. Beautiful right there. Multiple rhymes back to back to back right there. Activated divine hick. Activated divine hick. Universal line. There's my sign. Here's your sign. Motherfucker. Church. <laughs> He's always got one in there that absolutely floors me. There it was. Activated divine hick. Shut the fuck up, bro. <laughs> I love it. I'm all here for it. That's fucking incredible right there. Universal line. There's my sign, but here's your sign. Right? You guys know what the fuck here's your sign is from. As a sidekick, don't give a damn who you side with. Barging in the room, the levee broke my flow level at high risk. The levee's broken, he says. Wow. Wow. As a sidekick, don't give a damn who you side with. Barging in the room, the levee broke my flow level at high risk, and I might flood a motherfucker. Yeah, and I might disappear for nothing. I might go and grab the ghillie, the ghillie suit. Ah, uh, camouflage and so fall from head to toe, right? Sneak around every enemy that envy the fact that I don't ever sleep. Shh. Yeah, people always accusing Church of fucking, like, being on all kinds of drugs and shit because he would stay up for a long time. He would just be working the whole time, making music and shit. And people would be like, uh, how, how are you going to tell somebody when they have to go to bed when they're a grown fucking adult that's literally fucking made a career as an independent artist and can do and have whatever they want and provide anything to anyone that they want to. Like, how the fuck you gonna tell a grown man to go to bed? <laughs> Y'all motherfuckers are crazy, I'm telling you. <laughs> Y'all are fucking wild. Like, shut up. <laughs> and I might flood a motherfucker. Yeah. And I might disappear for nothing. Yeah, and I might go and grab the ghillie, sneak around every enemy to envy the fact that I don't never sleep. And I don't never have dreams, all I got is overseas. Now you're getting noticed even overseas. Go ahead, hit my boat with your little jet ski. Find out that your boy was built like he was the Roman seed. Standing near me too close, you hear pianos, lower keys. I'm Beethoven, bitch, I love playing broken strings. One of the dopest poets to ever be spoken on the scene. I'm the shit your weak ass, like nothing but poet be. The wordplay in this is already better than fucking the entirety of God mode. I mean, I understand that Tom, like, told a big part of his story that was very deeply important to him, and I think it's awesome that he did that in that song. Like, I'm not saying that, I'm not, like, saying that to trash Tom, but, like, the bars that Church is displaying right here are so goddamn witty and so creative and so well thought out and pieced together. He did this probably as a freestyle while on tour, just because he was probably bored. Like, that's the difference, okay? We have to at least acknowledge the difference, right, between what Church does and what Tom does. 
The fact of the matter is, bar for bar, Upchurch is a better spitter when it comes to the witty, lyrical flows. Tom is a great storyteller, and he can play to a lot of topics and pander to a lot of things and make catchy songs off of it. And there is a message in it. I'm not going to say that there isn't a message. It's just that they're two total opposite ends of the spectrum, and you kind of have to fucking acknowledge that whenever it comes to breaking songs down like this, especially diss tracks and shit like that. They're two totally opposite ends of the spectrum, and Church is putting that on display with what he's doing right here. Like, bar for bar, these are a hundred times more witty than a single thing that came out of Tom's mouth in God Mode. I respect the storytelling, and I enjoyed breaking that song down. Like I said, that's not to trash Tom, it's just... In my opinion, this is better wordplay, right? This is much better wordplay. I'm just saying, man. That's how I feel about it. That's my honest opinion. So Church says, I don't never have dreams. All I got is overseed. Name getting noticed even overseas. That's facts, man. Australia loves Church. I know that for a fact. The Aussies love Church. They've told me. <laughs> They're fucking really into his music over in Australia. Church, you got a big fan base over there. They like you. Go ahead and hit my boat with your little jet ski. Find out that your boy was built like he was the Roman scene. <laughs> but he's roaming, like, ro and roaming signal, like, on a cell phone as well. Man, there's a lot of ways you could take that one. What the fuck, Church? <laughs> See what I mean? When you think about the way he says things, it could mean so much like three different things a lot of the time fuck we've had one that was like six or seven before it was crazy he said standing near me too close you hear pianos lower keys mm, i'm beethoven bitch i love playing broken string <laughs> see what i mean <laughs> like it's just straight comedy Church, he said, I'm Beethoven, bitch. I love playing broken strings. Same. I used to break strings on my guitar while I was practicing, and then I wouldn't get to the store to buy new ones or something for a while, and I would just, like, still play my guitar with three strings and just use power chords. I know all about broken strings, man. I was that person. <laughs> One of the dopest poets to ever be spoken on the scene. I'm the shit. Your weak ass ain't nothing but poet feed. He said, you're food for me. Like, I can play. He's What he's saying there is that you're just, um, you're satisfying my hunger to get rid of the bars that are stuck inside of my head. He's saying that this is nothing to him. The serious music will go on the albums as, like, the storytelling and shit like that and songs like this. He's like, this is literally just me quenching myself, right? <laughs> like, making myself feel better and releasing these bars straight from my brain, right? <clears throat> That's the difference. That's what he's saying there. I believe it, man. I was watching, um, I wonder if the next part's up yet. I don't know if the next part is up, but I was watching the, the uh, Big Omega Zeus fucking interview with Church, where Church started writing the fucking song with a beat. I'm going to have to check and see if the next part of that's up because I want to see if they finished writing that and showing more of that process because I was really enjoying that, watching that get done. But yeah, it's quick as fuck with Church. Like, you can see it in that big Omega fucking interview from a couple days back. It got put out like two days ago or something like that. Church started writing a song and within like fucking three minutes, it was like two, three minutes tops he already had the beginning of a song that was ready to be just shot directly fucking into, like, a magma cannon, right? <laughs> like, for real. That's how Church writes, man, and that's awesome. He's putting it on display with tracks like this. Playing broken strings. One of the dopest poets to ever be spoken on the scene. I'm the shit your weak ass like nothing but poet be. Somebody put the spotlight on Princess. Report his politics. Same rhyme, same theme list. As he pops up on a TV with the dip, shits won't leave Hollywood cause you be acting for the crisis. Oh my god, no. <laughs> he just called Tom's music a crisis act. <laughs> Tom, you. I'm telling you, Tom, 
at some point, it's not just going to be church anymore. It's not just going to be church anymore at some point, and it's going to be somebody that you're actually going to have to respond to. I'm just saying that, man. I'm just saying. You might want to get over that hump while you can still, because it's going to be a lot of fucking shit that comes in that direction. And that's not saying that I wish that upon anybody, because I don't. It's just that's the situation that we're in, and people are going to start feeling a type of way after a certain point, and we've arrived at that point. I mean, like I said, God Mode was Tom doing his thing for eight and a half minutes, and it's like, there were good bars in it, and the storytelling, I like that he told his story and everything like that, but... Bar for bar, this is a hundred fucking times better in less than half the time. That's my opinion on it. That's how I feel about it. Ghost rider like, damn, why you start to cry? Hold on, okay, hold on. He's dropping the beat down and slowing it down. Let's talk about these other lyrics real quick. Somebody put the spotlight on Princess. The disrespect, to though. Princess Peach, are you call Oh my god. I know what you're doing there. <laughs> Report is politics, same rhyme, same theme list as he pops up on the TV with the dipshits. Won't leave Hollywood because you'd be acting for the crisis. <sighs> boy. Boy, oh boy, church. Blunt as fuck. Somebody put the spotlight on Princess Report his politics Same rhyme, same theme list As he pops up on the TV with the dipshits Won't leave Hollywood cause you be acting for the crisis Ghost writer like, damn, why you start to cry, sis? Cause up church won't stop, and it really do the shit Gonna struck, always gonna have a fucking buzz And nobody touching me, electricity through a cow fence Keep a straight face in my office like you Mike Pence Voice loud, loud, speeches even giving mic dance Got the blue jeans, I ain't tucking my pants Walk it like I wrote it way back 1776 Ain't no Yankee when I do the rooster, got the feather pen Accident Church, stop this <laughs> He's such a menace, dude. It's too much. <laughs> Ghost writer like, damn, why you start to cry, sis? He said you're ghost writer asking you why you're crying. Church, you're disrespectful sometimes, man. <laughs> <coughs> Cause up church won't stop any really do the shit. Thunderstruck always gonna have a fucking buzz and nobody touching me electricity through a cow fence. This rhyme scheme, his rhyme schemes, like I said, they're golden, man. Keep a straight face in my office like you Mike Pence. Fuck yeah, bro. Fuck yeah, I like that bar. <laughs> Voice loud, loud screeches even given Mike dents. Wow. Got the blue jeans, I ain't talking my pants. Walk it like I wrote it way back 1776. Church's schemes are different, dude. This is a rhyme scheme from hell right here. Church is on a different... I don't know what level Church has ascended to this year, but it's better than anything he's ever been on before. Wordplay watch. Jeans, I ain't tucking my pants. Walk it like I wrote it way back 1776. Ain't no Yankee when I do the rooster, got the feather pen. Yeah. Accidentally seeing with whispering lethal synonym. I don't want no new friends coming for my credit. I don't want no who this better come with leverage. I ain't making no careers cause it's steeple, now a staple. And they ain't saying my name like I'm cursed inside a riddle. Motherfucker, motherfucker. Chuck, chuck. Alright, now let's roll one and go back to the beach, bro. Wait, wait, so you came from the beach to do that, and then, oh my god, oh, that was a joint rolling session, that's what that was for church, that was a let's go roll this joint and then go back to the beach.
he decided to spit some bars while they went to roll. That's what this was. He just said it right at the end there. <laughs> oh my goodness. I bet it... Good God. That's fucking hilarious, bro. That's fucking hilarious. These last bars, I love this scheme he got on here. This scheme was awesome right here. Ain't no Yankee when I doodle rooster got the feather pen. Accidentally send when whisper and lethal synonym. Accidentally send when whisper and lethal synonym. Oh, man. Oh, man. Mm. He's saying you even sn what he's saying is you even sublim said a bar about the guy that you destroyed in your last battle, but you accidentally hit send like you said it out loud. That's what it. <laughs> Church, you're fucking funny, bro. <laughs> I said that too. I said that too right at the end of that. I said that he might as well have just fucking said some names at that point because it was clear who he was talking about in all manners. Like, I said that as well, so. I mean, I agree. I don't want no new friends coming for my credit. I don't want no who this better come with leverage. He's saying you better already have some of your own and leverage on yourself before you try to come to me. I ain't making no careers because the steeple now a staple. Yeah, he's saying I've become a staple. I am who I am, and everybody knows that I'm meant to be here in the position that I'm in. Right? That's what he's saying right there. He's saying, so I'm not making any careers. If you're going to come at me, come at me right and already have your own leverage. Don't be asking for favors, essentially, is what he's saying there. Not in a disrespectful way. He's just saying where he's at at this point of his life, and I agree with that. People have fucked church over. He's been through a hell of a lot in his career. I understand him feeling like that about everything that he is currently living right now. So, and they ain't saying my name like I'm cursed inside a riddle, motherfucker. Ah, uh, that's because you're fucking unsolvable. No one can figure out how to approach it, right? That's what he's saying there. He says I've. it's like he's cursed inside of a riddle. There's no answer for him. There's no answer, right? <laughs> no response. <sighs> There's no answer. Yeah, you're right. you fucking right. A backhanded one, if anything. I mean, let's just be real. Let's keep it real. I'm not saying that in a biased manner. Like, that's what it fucking was. So... <sighs> Who knows, church? Who knows? We're all here for you. We love it. This was fucking fantastic. You killed it, my guy. <laughs> the fucking wordplay and this was crazy. Fucking wordplay was crazy. So if you happen to see this, man, great job. Awesome job jumping on a Drake beat like this so quickly. The same beat that Drake fucking went at like 20 people with. And Drake did a hell of a job on this beat as well. So go check out the original for this as well. Drake's version. He definitely had some very solid bars inside of his version of this as well. But Church here went on some wordplay that's just absolutely insane. Very unorthodox, beautiful schemes. Much more creative than, in my opinion, the artist Tom that this was fucking aimed at, right? Sir Tom. I think this was much more creative than what he had to offer with eight and a half minutes of ours. That's just my personal opinion. Church said a lot inside of this. That was very good wordplay. A lot of doubles, a lot of triples. Some that I probably even missed, right? I'm sure that there were some that I'll find later on and be like, shit, I can't believe I didn't notice that when I was reading it out loud. That's the thing about Church's lyrics. They're so fucking layered that You'll find new ones each listen when it comes to songs like these ones. So you really got to dive in and just listen to them over and over. And you'll find those bars inside of there, man. I really, really enjoyed this a lot. For a diss track. Hey, he didn't say a name. Notice how Church did it. He said, fuck it, I won't say a name either. I'll just keep talking about you then. <laughs> What if that becomes the back and forth? What if they just stay sneak dissing each other for like the next year and then fucking Tom finally says a name or something because he gets mad? Right. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> you can't ignore shit like this being said about you. Like, it gets through. People message you and shit. Like, you can't say that you didn't see this. I don't give a shit how many views it has or how big of a song it is. You can't say that you didn't hear something like this because this is disrespectful, right? <laughs> you can't say you didn't hear it. You know you did, right? The original video will be in the description. As always, subscribe to Church. Subscribe to Captain Kurt. Support everybody that we feature on the channel. I appreciate you guys tuning in. I really enjoyed this a whole lot. It was a blast to break these down. I hope you guys enjoyed this breakdown. It's always great to have some church on the channel. So Creek Squad, I hope that y'all have a beautiful night. I appreciate you tuning in. I really enjoyed this one. I'm Vacasa Kavi. A reaction video a day keeps the doctor away. Fuck those apples. Leave a like for me. Comment those suggestions. Subscribe up this way. Bang the notification bell for me. I'll see you guys in the next ones. I love you so much. Thank you for everything. Have a blessed night. Peace.